the audience only bought this. They only bought what's in the box. And that's what our big responsibility is, to make sure that what happens in that box is professional, is sharp, is focused, is living, because it's, it's what the audience bought it to see. They just kind of set up this show to like run its course through it completely. Right. Yeah. They're the one that everybody goes to if they have a problem, especially. Very true, great answer. Um, just make sure like keep uh, everyone in pain and like make sure the show goes on no matter what happens. These are great answers. You guys actually understand. Stage management is a lot about psychology and knowing how to talk to people and how to like get what you, it seems very manipulative, but like get what you need from certain people and everyone's different, right? So part of that is like making people feel good. So you know this person needs, okay, you did a great job today and like needs a little pick me up. There's some people you're like, nope, you just let them be, do their thing. A lot of our job is like we, um, you know, people who don't sign in or people who come in late and dealing with that. And we also have a very similar philosophy about accepting who people are, right, as actors instead of like constantly fighting them. Mm -hmm. But I think part of it is knowing when you're like, okay, no more, you're not going to be late anymore, we're going to work on this and help them get what you want, right, instead of just sort of chastising people or stuff like that. They keep everything in track and online and constantly going with no hiccups during the rehearsal and actually performing it in front of the audience itself. Yeah. We sort of know a little bit about everything and because of that we're able to make sure, oh well you want to see this person for a costume fitting, but we understand the every domino that's gonna fall if we let that person out of the rehearsal room. And so we are on the one hand very administrative when we're in rehearsal or even in performance. And then we also know when technical things are going wrong, like when lights don't look correct, or when the costumes are sort of in a, something's happened, or um, when you have a new person that's in the show, how to talk to an actor who's having trouble with a scene, or things like that. So um, I think aligning is a really good way of looking at it. I heard something about leadership once that it's like sailing a boat, and like the, 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 um, the, course has been charted out, but it's up to the captains and the people on the ship to sort of make sure that you stay on that course and that you're going in the right direction.